Hey guys, Kate here. Thank you so much for over 1,400 subscribers. I'm so glad that people have been leaving me really encouraging comments, saying that they really enjoy my content. After being on YouTube for over a year, it really means a lot to me. With that said, I'd like to address one little thing before I get on to some more exciting stuff. So if you would, please listen until the end of the video. The Commission Horror Story video will no longer be on my channel. Thank you to everyone who was supportive of me through that situation. I got a lot of comments saying that people felt bad for me. That really wasn't the point of the video. My point was more I wanted people to be careful who they commission on Furry Amino because a lot of the time people are unexperienced either with PayPal or just with doing commissions in general. You should be careful even on Fur Affinity and other sites like that. So the biggest reason why I deleted that video, I started feeling really bad about it. I had a lot of comments that brought some good points to the table. Overall, I felt like that issue could have been handled a little bit better on both sides, on my part and on the other person's part. They weren't the only ones being immature about it. I also was immature in some parts of the video. But overall, I felt like I could have handled it better than just making a YouTube rant. I felt bad especially because I mentioned their name. I didn't link to their profile, but I did mention their name. Unfortunately, a lot of people did not read my description box. I said specifically not to harass or message the person, and we had some people go out and find this person and leave comments on their profile. So I apologize greatly for that. I should not have mentioned this person's name, but I want everyone to know that if you did support me through that, thank you so much, but the entire thing is over. I got my money back. It is done. Done, and the video is no longer up. I will also not be making any more rant videos because I feel like that's not the type of person that I am. That's not the type of videos that I want to make on my channel. Thank you for your understanding. So now for more exciting news. I would like to announce that tonight at 6 p.m to 9 p.m central standard time. Be sure to check your time zone I will be hosting an art stream on this channel. I will also consider taking commissions during the stream. I currently have a few commissions that I will be working on tonight. I have also enabled the sponsor and super chat features for people to donate if they feel so inclined. Please don't feel obligated to donate, but any donations are highly appreciated, so I hope to see you there. Next, I would like to showcase some gift art, trades, and commissions that I have received from people. All of these artists, channels, or profiles, or pages will be linked in the description box down below. So first up, we have Beloved Fox. They made me this amazing gift art. Thank you so much for this. I absolutely love the way that this turned out. The pose and the color palette is just adorable. I've been wanting to draw my character in this position, like a swimming position for so long, but it's just really hard for me to do perspective. But you nailed it on this. Thank you so much. Next up, we have some gift art by Clockwork Geode. Fun little story. Um, Clockwork Geode and I actually went to high school together and we recently reconnected with each other and she made me this amazing gift art. Thank you so, so much. Next up, I'd like to give a thank you to Arctic Furs for trading with me. We did a badge trade. If you watched my recent drawing video, I actually worked on the badge that I made for Arctic Furs in that video. Here is some of the art that I've commissioned over the past couple months or so. Bitter Bite on Furry Amino. They created my YouTube icon and my ref sheet. Thank you to Pinely. This is one of my favorite commissions that I've ever gotten because I was on Fur Affinity and I saw people posting like fall themed 
pictures of their fursonas, so I asked them to create this for me with like my little skeleton hoodie that I actually have and sitting in a pile of leaves with a cup of hot cocoa. Like, I love this picture so much. And last but certainly not least, Coidel Coyote made this amazing line art for me a while back now. It was, I think it might have been over the summer. I did the coloring and shading, but they created the line art. They have a very toony style. I really like how it turned out. Thank you so much. That's gonna about do it for this video, guys. If you did like this, please give it a like down below and feel free to check out any of these artists if you're interested in commissions or trades. I think some of them do trades. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.